All right, everyone. How's it going, guys? Chemist here. And today we're going to start the next episode of our Pokemon Crystal 2.0 walkthrough. Just a team recap, because it's been a couple days since I've posted one of these. We got Sinister at level 33, Dexter's 31, Bruce is 32, Fireball's also 32, Electabuzz is 31, and Squirt is 33. So, yeah, yeah, so that's our team. It's pretty well rounded. And actually, we have some, some housekeeping we need to do real quick. Let us fly to Goldenrod. Okay, and we now will get to nickname Electabuzz. So the reason I was waiting to post the next episode is because I wanted to wait till someone commented so we could give our last member a proper name. So I think this is the nicknamer's house. No, no, maybe it's this one. Yep, here we go. Okay, name raider. Yes, I definitely want you to write a name. And let's name Electabuzz. Okay, so if you guys check out the last video, uh, the first person to comment a nickname for Electabuzz uh, gave it the name Chocolate, which is awesome. That's a that's a great nickname. So let's make sure it'll fit. Yes, it will fit. Using all of those. Okay, good. All right, so now every Pokemon on our team has a nickname. So now Electabuzz officially feels like part of the family. So let's uh, get the stats for her. There's Chocolate. All right, so there's all three Elemental Punches and the TN uh, Strength. Okay, cool. So, all right, so now what we need to do is we need to go ahead and start our battle with Team Rocket. So let us do that. Oh man, so I hope you guys are having fun watching this series. Um, we're about to do a whole bunch of Team Rocket battles. So grab some food, grab your game, and uh, let's dig on in. Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. Yeah, so it turns out they have a basement under here. Boom! He just, he just knew there was a staircase there. So he wants to split up, and he's gonna go first. Lance's overworld sprite looks really cool too. So this is a really cool way they made you battle Team Rocket, because uh, you have a lot of puzzles that you have to, uh, that you have to solve in order to, to get through. So I like that they did that instead of just making it a, um, you know, just a plain uh, battle. Uh, series of Team Rocket runs. They added some puzzles in there too to help spice it up. I, I, I loved the puzzles in this game. I love I love having little brain teasers to do throughout my playthroughs. Okay, well I was gonna power up Espeon, but... Uh, oh yeah, we taught her sh or him Shadow Ball. Oh, excellent. Okay. I was like, dang. <laughs> I'm about to just have to switch Sinister right back out. Excellent, okay. And a Zubat. So actually, yes, Dexter is going to be an excellent Pokemon to battle through these. Ah, the days when we had a Zubat. Our Bruce has grown up so much. Alright. Excellent, okay. So, it's, uh, you know, at this point in the game, uh, the team is, the squad, you know, it's, it's finalized. So we've got all the members of our team and everything. Um, but, you know, what, what is your guys' team looking like? Uh, maybe, maybe at this point in the game, you probably have your, your finalized team assembled by now. So, unless you're gonna use a legendary. So, uh, so how about you guys comment down below and let me know what you guys are using. Um, because I, I play this game all the time, so I'd love to hear what you guys use uh, for your playthroughs. So I'm always looking for new teams to use. So, yeah. So, another Zubat. Okay. I do believe that after we battle these these Team Rocket grunts, there's, there's gotta be like a switch or something. Um, I can't quite remember. Radita. I always thought Radita looked cooler than Raticate, because, I mean, he, he's blue. I, I, that's actually pretty cool. But uh, Raticate is boring. So, if they would have kept him blue, that would have been pretty cool. Okay, now they're about to use Grimer. Man, Dexter is a great uh, option. For these, for these rocket Pokemon. 
and we're just plowing through. Excellent. Oh yeah, and we have the experience share on our squirt because I would very much like to get a Blastoise uh, pretty soon. Okay, so let's look for that switch. I know it's not on the other side of that statue. I think there's like a scientist dude somewhere down here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, they go around that. Oh, they force you to battle him. I see. This was once a ninja hideout. You know, you don't see enough ninja hideouts today, you know? That's just not something you run across every now and then. Oh man, Scientist Jed. Sent out Magnemite. Okay. So let's see here. I doubt that'll be a one hit kill. Yeah. Because steel is resistant. Oh, he used supersonic. Are you kidding me? Uh, let's try to get a quick attack off. Dang. Sad times. Alright, Sonic Man did a pretty decent amount. Oh, oh, not confused anymore. Dang, I've been pretty bad at power. Scientist Jed, you know. Okay. He's got three. Um, yeah, you know what? I'll send Fireball out here. Clean these Magnemites up. Give him a flame wheel. Awesome. Okay. Man, he had three Magnemites. That's like one thing. I, I guess I should have changed that. Um, it's just hard to know which ones have all sets of the same Pokemon. But I, I, I should have, I should have changed the. T the, the the people that just have, like, all the same Pokemon. That's just, it gets so exhausting just fighting three Magamites over and over and over again. But, um, you know, all the trainer data is stored in one massive file for this ROM. So it's pretty hard to know which one, which trainers specifically. Oh, okay, cool. So we pressed that switch. So now we should be able to walk past the statues. Yeah, okay. So now we can, oh, a Hyper Potion, heck yeah. Okay, so now we can walk past the statues and the alarms won't trigger. So let's see, another ball. Oh, a nugget? Oh, okay, I'll get rid of something for a nugget. You best believe. Let's see. Hmm. Uh, you know what? Don't really care too much about the guard spec. Yeah, because I will take the nugget, because that's, uh, that's $5,000. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, hey, it's, uh, Lance. Oh, and he heals up the squad? What a good dude. Okay, and he runs off to go ahead and start taking out some more Team Rockets, but we need codes to get into that gate right there. You brought a little pest? And those words cut deep. Uh, rocket grunt insults. Okay, we got a Venonat. Okay, that's not gonna be good for, for Dexter. Let's, let's see how much of confusion I'll do. Boom, okay, good. Okay, Squirt's gotta be pretty close to leveling up. So that make him 34? Yeah, so I, th I think with all these rocket grunts, we, we should be able to evolve uh, Squirt this episode. Excellent, okay. Sent some money to mom. Okay, do you tell us the password? Huh, only the boss knows the password for that door. Where's the boss? Who knows? Go look for yourself. Okay, uh, so he is not one with the password. Oh, you know what? There are two doors that need passwords. This is one, but there, there, there's some more. Okay. Uh, is there anything over here? No? Nope. Okay. 
door open? Oh, duh, it has to have a password that only Team Rocket knows. Okay, cool. Okay, so may maybe he, he knows a password. I know you need two, and I know they have something to do with tails, like Slowpoke Tail or, or something along those lines. Okay, Goldbat's pretty, pretty tanky, as we found out from our team, but don't think he's going to be able to survive Dexter's confusion. Oh, oh, that was it? Oh, Alright. I was expecting like three of them. Let's see... I'm just a grunt. I don't know the password. Too bad for you. Okay, so we need to find like some executive or something. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. So there's two passwords. Uh, urgh, the guy in the cave is incredibly tough. Well done, he's the freaking champion. And a full heal? Okay, you know what, guys? We're gonna have to get rid of something for that full heal as well. Um, and we will toss a paralyzed heal. Because a full heal is the same thing. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. I think we can fight these scientists? He used to work for Silco. And a meddling kid like me needs to be punished. Okay, you know what, guys? Team Rocket gives scientists a really bad name, because I promise that we're not like this in real life. Well, you know, some are. Some are real jerks, but not most. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, I think uh, Dexter was a good lead choice for, for down here. Coughing's pretty worthless, but Weezing's pretty tanky. Well, Weezing's a pretty tanky uh, poison Pokemon for Gen 2. It's, uh, it's pretty good to, to use through. Scientist Ross. Dang, $2,200. Pokemon paint the picture that scientists make creative money. Do I know the password? Maybe. But no weakling's going to get it. Well, no weakling, so I think you're gonna hand it right on over. I was wondering how I had so much PP, but I forgot Lance kind of like healed all of our Pokemon for us. That makes a big difference. Most of the times when you do these like long... Oh, score good with 4 to 34! Heck yes! But yeah, mo most of the time when you when you do these like little like long missions for the main story, it's a... Uh, you know, most of the time you just, you just run out of PP. You don't really run out of like usable Pokemon, you know, like health-wise. You just... you just don't have moves <laughs> to use, so... Okay, I'm gonna stop. Oh, okay, got some money too. Cool. Let's talk to her. The password to the boss's room is Slowpoke Tail. Excellent. But unless you have two passwords, it's useless. Alright. So one down, one to go. Let's explore around here. Okay. I don't care that Pokemon are hurt by our experiment. Uh, okay, well, there's that. <laughs> At least he's blunt. Ditto. <laughs> How lame. It would be really hard to do a playthrough of Pokemon Crystal, and you only had one Pokemon, and that only Pokemon was Ditto. Like, that, that would be a very challenging way to, to beat this game, if you were ever looking for a challenge. <laughs> okay, do you have a password? Hook, hook, hook. Okay, he likes to have guts. Yeah, you're gonna tell me a password, that's what I thought. Okay. Let's see. He's gonna eradicate. Chomp chomp. Okay. Got a confusion up. Yeah, these Pokemon on the Team Rocket Grunts, like, I mean, they're just. They're just not high enough level. To impose any type of threat. Okay, what's that other password? Is it Eradicate Tail? Yeah, it's Eradicate Tail. Okay, I don't really want an X special. Okay, I do want a protein. Let's see here. 
Awesome. Okay, so we found a protein, and now let's go to that protein, and let us give it to Sinister. Make sure all those DVs are high up. It's really cool in Gen 2 because um, this is before EVs and IVs were a thing. You had something called DVs, and, um, you know, you just, you fill up all DVs. Uh, no, matter, no matter what, you know, it's not like EVs and IVs are now. Um, you just, you fit them up all the time. Like, so, a, uh, a high-level Pokemon that's been like, doing a lot of battles will will just have full DVs when you fight it by the time you're done with your playthrough. But eliminate you, I must. Okay. Interesting choice of words. Okay, so we got that Radita. Fusion. So, usually when I'm doing my own playthrough, um, not like when I'm recording for YouTube, but when I'm just, you know, playing Pokemon on my own, like in my leisure time, uh, I made a video about a PS Vita, and that's usually what I play on, and for those of you who haven't been keeping up, uh, all, all PS Vita firmwares can, can now be uh, hacked for, for emulation. So that has made uh, the PS Vita, like, literally one of the best uh, like choices you can buy now for handheld emulation um, in that price range now. Like, they're, they're cheap because they're not wanted anymore. They're done with their life cycle. And they have a lot of colors, so if you're a color person, you know, you can get like, it's like an aqua blue one and a, a white one. They all look good. And now you don't have to have the 3.60 firmware. You can you can have any firmware. So that's, that's awesome. Like, that's, that's going to breathe a lot of life into into uh, into the PS Vita. Oh dang, our rival! Oh, I didn't remember that. Okay, didn't I tell you that I was going to destroy Team Rocket? Tell me, who was the guy in the cave who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. That's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. Hm. I don't have time for the likes of you. Yeah, the the rival has a lot of uh coming around. I, I, I like the story behind him. Okay, so we're gonna add the two pa or put the two passwords in, be able to go into this door, face this executive, and look at that. There is the Murkrow Pokemon Overworld Sprite that you would not usually see in um uh, in the normal game because there weren't individual sprites for each Pokemon. Okay, Giovanni. Since disbanding Team Rocket three years ago, he has been in training, but we're certain he will be back someday to assume command again. That's why we're standing guard. I want anyone to disturb this place. Okay. So, what all do you have on your team? I think it's like a Houndoom or a Houndor. Okay, if you have a Zubat, you probably have a Houndor. Maybe it's later on down the road when we battle him. He has stronger Pokemon. Okay, so... Zubats in the bag. Okay, Dexter go to level 32. As if anyone else on this rocket team needed a... <laughs> needed a stronger Dexter. Oh, he's learning a stronger Psychic move. <laughs> oh, they're really in for a treat. Okay, let's see... Um... Let's get rid of confusion. Now we got Sabine. Uh, yeah, you know, let's try and... Let's get Shock with some love. Because Raticate won't be hard for Shock with a beat. Let's see, let's do Thunder Punch. Get that stab. Okay, so he's scary face, so speed fell, so I think no, no, that was enough to make him get out sped. Okay, so I'm punch him in, eradicates down. Okay, so 
No, he has a coffin. Maybe you're thinking of someone else that has the Houndor or Houndoom. Um... Let's send Dexter out. Man, I really thought his team was going to be a lot more uh, challenging than it is. Ooh, Psybeam looks cool. affect me. I have to inform the others. Okay, cool. And then we need to talk to Mr. Murkrow over here. The password is Hail Giovanni. Okay. So now let us make our way Oh, hello. Found TM46. Okay. I think that's Thief. Okay, so let's make our way back. To the other gate. No, okay, upstairs. Yes, here we go. Door closed. Can we see the password? It opened up. Heck yes. Hold it right there. Ah, oh, you gonna double team me? Now something that's really cool that they did in Heart Gold and Soul Silver is they uh, they made this a, a double battle, which was was awesome. It was a way for them to incorporate double battles without having to change any of the story. Okay, the interim. <laughs> oh, okay. You know what? Maybe she's the one with the hound. Okay, so she had an R block, so she's she's bringing the game. But yeah, still no, still no match. Okay, so knocked out the Arbok pretty easy. Who's next? Oh, she's got a Murkrow. Okay, I respect your choice. Murkrow's a cool Pokemon. We'll bring Chocolate out, get him some screen t or her some screen time now that uh now that she has a nickname. That should be enough to take that out. Yeah, there we go. Murkrow is so cool with his little hat. <laughs> okay, and now a Gloom. So I will send out Fireball for Gloom. No, I, sw I swear, some someone on Team Rocket has a Hound Dude. Our levels are palindromic. If you guys don't know what a palindrome is, you can go Google that. It shows up all the time. You learn about it. Only words, anything can be a palindrome, but you learn about it a lot in genetics too, because there's something called palindromic DNA. Okay, this hideout is done for. But that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. Foo, 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 foo. That did it. We defeated them. Okay. I'm concerned about the guy battled in the process. Sorry, Guinness. I saw how well you were doing. So I just come back. Now all there is left to do is turn off that odd radio signal. Hmm. It's this machine that's causing all the problems, and there is no switch. We have no choice. We have to make all the electrode faint. Um, it's no fault of the Pokemon, so it makes me feel guilty. Chemist, let's put the job. Yeah, I'm just murdering all these uh, electrode. Okay. And I'm level 23, too. Hmm. Side beam should be enough. Dang, he went through. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. What a jerk. Thank goodness Electrode uh, has a pretty low attack. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we gotta use a different Pokemon. Let's see. 
I'll use Fireball. Because we still need to evolve him as well. Because once we get a Typhlosion, Fireball is going to become a uh, pretty big contributor to the team. Same thing with Blastoise. We just need to get those third evolutions. And then I guess that'll be the uh, the actual like final final team. Because everyone will be fully evolved and everything. Awesome. be use Screech and self-destructs. Uh, I gotta respect the strategy, but... Uh. Okay, um... Do a quick attack just in case. Good. Didn't want to risk it, guys. Okay, last one. Maybe we can get a critical hit. Yeah, Electro is ridiculously fast. Dang, didn't get a crit. But we'll quick attack. Good enough. Squirt's level 35, heck yes! Excellent! Okay. So Lance did his thing. Had to be super easy with a freaking Dragonite. Okay, that odd signal has finally stopped. The light should be back to normal. You're the hero. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. So I got HM06. I forget what that is. Oh, Whirlpool. Okay. You can use that out of battle only with the badge from the Mahogany Gym. Okay, can this journey be becoming the Pokemon Master is long and difficult? Uh, knowing that, will you keep going? I see. No, you're right. If you give up that easily, you would have never chased that dream in the first place. Man, Kim is clapping back with them uh, witty remarks. Okay, so let's see here. I'm gonna step on this conveniently placed pad and uh, bounce on out of here. Yep, yep. Okay, so let's see. So let's heal the squad up. And then. What is the gem here? Is it is it psychic? Is this the psychic gem? Let's see. No, this is the ice gem. Okay, cool. So we can actually. Uh, you know what? Some of these are ice and water. So let's let's bump uh. Let's bump chocolate up there because he knows the elemental punches too. Okay, I want to make sure I battle everyone here and get that experience. I freeze your Pokemon, they can't do a thing. You know, if your Pokemon got frozen in Gen 1, you truly were screwed. <laughs> uh, especially in a competitive battle. Okay, see, see, this was a good choice to have a chocolate. Okay, good. So we're gonna train him. Too easy. Okay. Alright, Squirt. Okay, we got Duong. Duong is a cool looking Pokemon. Duong might actually survive that one. No? Okay. Chocolate just can't be trialed with. Okay, I like how his tail like collapse. <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah, we should totally have a Blastoise by the end of this gym. Like, no, no question. Okay, so, let's see. Let's see if we can make sure we find the other one. Okay, good. I want to battle him. Oh, crap, I already solved the puzzle. Crap. Um, well, I want to, I want to battle all the trainers. Get that XP. Oh, he's got a shoulder. Cloyster is a dope looking Pokemon. Yeah, I think if I wouldn't have caught a Squirtle, so that way we would have had a Blastoise, I think I would have done this playthrough 
with a cloister because I know that Star Me just you know runs rampage on this entire game, but uh, I just think cloister looks so much cooler. I mean, I mean, look at him. He is so dope. Oh, he used protect. What's the point? He will probably survive that because he is bulky. Yeah, yeah. All right. Cool. Okay. 540. Heck yeah. Border Douglas. Oh, wait. There's a secret? What's the secret, dude? The secret behind Price's power. He meditates under a waterfall to strengthen his mind and body. Oh, okay. Well, that's, that's cool. Alright, let's talk to you. Okay, what's this border got? Brad. Superb. Alright, I think I will use Fire Punch on you. I will use some door. Oh, I see you. Use Ice Punch since that'll be enough to take it out. Oh, Shock of Little Level 32, excellent. Okay, Attack 64, Special Attack 76, okay. So we definitely need you to learn Thunderbolt, bud. Take advantage of that special attack. Eighteen hundred dollars, man. These these kids are paying out pretty nice. Okay, so let's talk to her. Okay, I I think those are the only trainers in here. I think I think she's the last one. Roxanne. Oh, she's got Jinx. Jinx is a cool Pokemon too. Chocolate, like just like just running rampage on this gym. Okay, that should be enough to evolve. Squirt, no, dang, Squirt's gonna be so close. 2016. Okay, so now we know how to. Oh no, one more. Good, good. Check out my parallel turn. So she's probably a skier as well. Yeah. I like how like this sprite right here, this character, and her overworld sprite just have like completely different hair color. <laughs> it's, 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 it's it's hysterical. Okay, I got another Duong. Duong is, is difficult to beat. Ooh, this one might, might rip through. I don't know what level Chocolate learns Thunderbolt. Dang, yeah, he lived through. Okay, I'm just gonna use Ice Punch since that's gonna be enough to take it out. Dang, still not enough to evolve a squirt. Okay. So it's time to get to Bryce. Let's see here. Even the gems are puzzles. I too have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I am your elder, let me show you what I mean. I have been with Pokemon since before you were born. I do not lose easily. I demonstrate my power. Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, Bryce is looking pretty old. He's looking pretty aged. Oh yeah, yeah. So I, this is this is the team I gave him too. Yeah. So I gave him a buffed up Cloister, freaking level forty. So, hopefully we can get a paralysis on this dude, because it's going to be hard to beat this cloister. Nope. Okay. And he was able to land a supersonic. Come on, chocolate. 
No! Yeah, you know what? I really buffed up Spike Cannon. This cloister's gonna be a doozy. Hit five times. Come on, chocolate. 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 Yeah. Okay, let's get the, the perilous axe. You know, and it used Aurora Beam. Dang, chocolate might be down. That might be enough. Dang, I really needed him not to die. Okay, let's just, um, hmm, Bruce would be a bad choice. Fireball would as well in this instance, so we're going to fall back on Dexter. So let's see here, get a side beam out. Quincer doesn't have very good special defense. Yeah, there we go, okay. 865! Oh, heck yes! It's worth level 36! Hmm, yeah. Okay, we got a Duong. Um, you know, I, I, it's like I want to use Fireball, but I think Duong is, is part water as well, so... Let's get a side beam out. Wow, that did like nothing. Okay. I keep staying inside me. Oh, heck yes! We got the confusion! Oh, it hurt itself. Excellent. Okay, cool. I forgot Sidebeam had a small chance to, to confuse. Yeah, oh, that headbutt is doing quite a bit. I wanted to use Sidebeam in the game because I was afraid he was going to use like a... <laughs> Like a super potion or something on him. Okay, cool. Oh, a Pila Swine. Okay, excellent. So now I can use Fireball. Oh, dang, it's all 45. Yeah, I should have done some uh, off screen grinding here. I forgot I made his team so good. <laughs> Dang, really could have used a, uh, a burn. Oh, I was gonna use three Dang, I was gonna do ten each time. Oh, okay, I can do... Eight to ten. Dang, he's putting the hurting on me. That's for sure. Dang, yeah, now he's gonna use a hyper potion. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to heal Fireball. I'm gonna have to survive there. There he goes. Dang, still no, no burn. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, oh, excellent. Okay, so we got that that heal in three. Dang, that burn would help so much because I'm pretty sure that fury attack is a physical attack. So, we're just getting unlucky with those. I just want my Blastoise! <laughs> just want to beat him so we can see War Turtle evolve. Yes, a critical hit. Okay. 700 XP. Cool. Surprise is defeated. You are worthy of this badge. And $4,500. Here it is, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's getting the cannons. He's getting the cannons. Oh, Blastoise looks so cool. Oh, look at him flexing them cannons. 
Oh, that is so dope. God, his sprite looks so good in this generation. Oh, that's that's awesome. I'm so happy. Canvas received the Glacier Badge. Raise the special. Use Whirlpool outside. And, okay, what does he give us? Is it Icy Wind or something? Yeah, it's Icy Wind. Okay, cool. So, real quick, let us go check out Blastoise. Excellent. Okay, so he looks freaking dope. And there's his stats. Okay, so... 82 attack, 7 has... Okay, so he has a high special or a physical attack. Dang. That is unfortunate. Okay. But he had a lot of health. Alright. Okay, so also, let's go ahead and bust out that TM, you know, and uh, let's see. Oh, uh, well, hmm. Let's see. Can Blast use like this? Yeah, okay, so we'll take advantage of that attack. Let's get rid of. Okay, cool. All right. Excellent. So we got our blast boys. There we go. Now we can get out of here. Okay. Oh, Professor Elm. Okay, what's up? Kenneth, how are things going? I called because something weird is happening with the radio broadcasts. They were talking about Team Rocket. Kenneth, do you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned. No, that just can't be true. Hard to bug you. Take care. Okay, yeah, so I think that this is the part of the game where Team Rocket has taken over the radio tower in, um, in Goldenrod City. So, in the next episode, we will fly to the radio tower and take on uh, Team Rocket inside uh, Goldenrod. So, make sure you tune in for that, and, uh... And yeah, guys, I, I appreciate everyone who watches these, and I, I hope you're enjoying, and as always, I hope you're playing along, and I hope you see you in the next one.